So World of Tanks for PC has already more than 80 million uh, registered accounts, but uh, there's another version, another version which is also reaching new frontiers, and that's the uh, Xbox 360 version with more than 2 million uh, downloads. Is that correct, right. Roman? Yes, you're right. Uh, but it's not the same game. Uh, well, even though the setting and the game mechanics uh, were uh, borrowed from its big brother, which is on the PC, uh, World of Tanks 206 is uh, totally a totally new game which was completely adapted for the console players. Uh, so while working on the game design, we have taken into consideration all the elements uh, that need to be improved uh, for the console players. Uh, the game interface uh, and uh, a lot of the game features were reworked to make sure that the gaming experience that we are providing to the console players as, uh, is as epic and fun as uh, the PC one. Do you think it, it can reach uh, its same uh, complexity? Uh, we are getting deeper features uh, soon, so so players also get first the accessibility and then and then they can reach uh, deeper. So what I can tell you already for sure is that the game mechanics on the 360 version are already deep enough, and as you just mentioned. Uh, uh, players who, uh, who have uh, two million of players who have downloaded the game <laughs> cannot make it wrong, right? Uh, s and the gameplay is uh, fun. Uh, how it is, however, more dynamic than on PC. And it also seems, um, uh, despite being a console game, that is uh, really uh, community focused. Uh, how are you keeping it community focused uh, um, when when it's the development is is so different to the PC version? Um, so one uh, on this part, you are also right. We have a huge community of players uh, playing the console version. Uh, we are also running uh, console forums uh, that we uh, support on uh, several languages, including French and Spanish, for instance. Uh, we work a lot of our community, and if our, our um, production schedule is not only taking into account the roadmap that we have designed for the game when we were planning it for the consoles, uh, we are also implementing the features that are suggested and requested by the community. Uh, our game developers are present on forums only on a daily basis, uh, communicate and share their ideas with the players. And this is uh, obviously the direction we want to uh, hold and improve. And, and I guess you're you're uh, taking that direction with new updates, same as with the PC version. But those are not the same as updates because it's a different game. So which are the new cool features we're getting in the 360 version we can expect in the following months? As you just mentioned, the both products are not at the same level. Obviously, one is older and has a, a big amount of features and a bigger community. The other one is younger. However, is uh, progressing very fast. Among the next biggest features that we have planned for the console version, uh, we have a team battle mode that was very popular when it was and still is very popular when it was introduced to the PC version. Uh, players will be able to fight in teams uh, of uh, seven versus seven. Uh, we have pl uh, planned uh, uh, more immersive effects, uh, more immersive uh, meteor effects. Uh, also, new, for instance, new uh, tech trees of new nations are coming. And this, it seems natural that the next uh, natural step uh, would be uh, getting the game on the Xbox One. Uh, we recently heard about the million of players that would be needed for, for it to, to exist. What can we know, we know about that? So what, what I can f what I know for sure is that Xbox One is a great console, and uh, um, they probably have already a huge uh, player base. However, when it comes to the 360 edition for the moment, is that we have to focus uh, on our community of players. So for the moment, we are focusing on that console. Anything else uh, we have to know about the 360 version? Anything new features? Uh, anything else you wanna 
mention? As I just mentioned, uh, the production schedule for the game is great. We're working on brand uh, new and uh, cool features that will be uh, uh, coming in the, the next updates, like the team battle mode, uh, new tech trees, and uh, uh, game features. But not radio-controlled tanks, right? <laughs> no, this is not fun. You can play them there. <laughs> I will. Thank you very much. <laughs> Have a good day.